What's up everyone? We're here in Farmingdale. Pretty quiet ramp. Short flight back to Teterboro. Let's uh, get on board this CJ3 Plus and get the flight going. everyone, welcome on board. Just waiting for the line guys to come. We're gonna set the parking brake here so they can pull the chalks. And get the seatbelt on and get the checklist going. So yeah, we're heading back to Teterboro and uh, should be a nice flight. Weather's gonna get uh, later on tonight a little rainy, uh, but right now it's just broken 6,000, so it's nice VFR conditions. We'll get the checklist up here and we'll fire up the engines. All right. Box system is good and in breakers I checked. Check it again, always good to double check. Gen switches are off for the GPU start. Phone goes on silent. It's good, battery's good. Controls, station, Parking brake is set, verified. Wheel chalks have been removed. Cabin door is closed. Air conditioner is off. Entrance messages are checked. We got 28 volts in the GPU. And uh, we'll start number two. Two. Clear right. Ignition. Fuel flow, oil pressure. That's a good start. Relay is out. Confirms. Let the engine settle. Clear left. There's ignition. And one, oil pressure. Temperatures are coming up. Relay is out. GPU, that's the disconnect sign. All right, well, tax out to runaway one, and uh, that looks good to me. All right, clear left, clear right, give my flash. And there's our sign clear left, clear right. Adios, amigo. We'll see ya. Alright, watch it. It's in this rain away We're using uh, windshield, uh, engine bleed air, uh, but it just helps us be able to see a little bit. If I bring up the throttles here, it will blow it away a little bit more. More pressure. There we go. New York approach, citation to Romeo Fox on the ground here at Republic. Clarence to Tito Yeah, that, this thing hasn't been working. I tried on the uh, ground earlier, did not work. I tried 25-7, see if that works. Near approach, November to Romeo Fox, on the ground here at Republic Clearance in Teterboro. I might have to call the phone number. Yeah. I have any 340 and you said yeah. All right, I gotta call the phone number, guys. It's a little different here. I'm not sure you guys can be able to hear this. So this might get edited out. Uh, good afternoon, sir. It's November 2, Romeo Fox. I'm trying to reach you on Unicom. I think it might be broken here, Republic. Uh, Clarence to Teterboro when you get a chance. 2, Romeo Fox, right? Yes, sir. That's us. Hold on. Right. Copy. Yes, sir. We're to Teterboro via Republic 1 departure. We're to Kennedy. Do this file. Maintain 3,000. Expect uh, 4,000 as a final. Departure frequency 125.7, squawk 4237. Alright, citation to our Fox, Republic 1 departure, Directors Kennedy has filed, maintain 3000, 4000, and 10, we're going high today. 25 7th New York, and then squawk 42, uh, 
Air China 645, heavy contact, Kennedy Tower, 1-1 one, at a point one today. All right, we'll do that. Yeah, we were trying 28 and 25, but we got nothing. But we'll try it again, and uh, thanks so much. Thank you. All right, bye. All right, not sure you guys heard that or not, but that's what we uh, that's what we got here. We'll check the uh, we got the avionics finished up here. So charts, departure on the Republic 1, off of runway 1. It's climb heading 013. Uh, 013, that's runway heading. Maintain 3,000, 3,000 set. All right, that looks good to me. We're just walking 4237, so let's get that in there. 4237 is in. All right, let's connect uh, approach and let's get out of here. Make approach, good afternoon. Citation to Romeo Fox, number one at runway one at Republic, ready for release. Citation to Romeo Fox, New York approach, your release for departure, clearance void if not off in 10 minutes, if not off in 10 minutes, advised no later than 15 minutes of intention. Roger that. Uh, thanks for a release for departure. If not off in 10 minutes, we'll call you no later than 15 minutes on this frequency. And we'll talk to you at 1 for 2 Romeo Fox. All right. We're released for departure. That's our means that we've had a non controlled airport, non towered airport. We do have to get our clearance on the ground to be released for departure. So 25 7 is going to be that. 18 8. All right. Parking brakes coming off. Alpha Fox, can you move up a few inches there, a few feet there? Absolutely, yeah, we we're just talking to New York. Sorry about that, getting RFR. Thanks for life, so fix You got it. All right, we always love the Gulfstream guys, um, except the baby Gulfstream guys, but to let those big guys behind us go and uh, be on the way. All right, let's get uh, Unicom's up, 18-8, 25-7's in. Republic traffic, November 2, Romeo Fox is departing runway 10, straight out departure, Republic. Clear left, clear right. The final is clear. Up and down, clear left. Birds, considerations, heats, lights, messages are normal. Engine instruments are looking good. Oh, what are some lights on? That's runway one. Take off. Take a power set and achieve two good engines. Airspeed is alive, both sides. 70 knots checks. V1, rotate. That's positive rate of climb. Gear up, please. V2 plus 10 knots. Flaps up. Your dampener. Flight level change. Climb power. Republic traffic number Terra Fox is on the up end uh, runway one to find the area. So long. Your departure citation, Terra Mia Fox, 1100, climbing to 3000. Terra Mia Fox, uh, near departure radar contact. Uh, maintain 3000. Maintain 3000, Terra Mia Fox. All right, 3000. That's good. Engines are coming on. Autopilot's coming on. Number two, Romeo Pasha, turn left, hitting 340 vectors for Teterboro and contact approach 120.8. All right, left turn 340 and New York's 20.8. Citation to Romeo Pasha, good day. Good day. All right, 340 and 3000, we're leveling here. We're in the uh, Bravo now, we'll still maintain 200 knots for now. Just until we, all right. After takeoff, gears up, flaps are up, throttles are well below climb. Pack state switch not an issue. Lights coming off. Pressurization is starting to come up. That's it. Uh, New York approach, how you doing? Citation to Romeo Fox, 3,340 heading. Citation to Romeo Fox, altimeter 2972 at LaGuardia, flighting 270. 270 heading, and then 2972 on the altimeter for Terra Fox. Afternoon, Toby. All right, 2972 is in, 72. All right. Yeah, I'll, I'll post my the original route here in a second, but uh, uh, this is quite a different route than we're going to be getting, and this is uh, just fantastic, really, to be honest. It's good stuff. All right, so it's below 10 degrees. 
it's visible moisture is outside. We do have the engine uh, anti-ice switches are on. That is to prevent any ice from accumulating on the TT2, PT2 probe, which is the total temperature and total pressure probes, which the FADEC system works off of. Two zero four six and a half void, if not off by two one three zero. All right. Yeah, we're in the Bravo, looking good. And I meant to say uh, two two three zero. All right, let's get some stuff working for Teterboro. Everything's going to happen pretty quick here, guys. Descents, uh, nothing applies. Lights, we got everything on. Altimeters are set. Landing data. So let's start. Uh, we'll use the eight core system. Do anything fun while you're on the ground at Farmingdale, Max? Nope. Just uh, currency flight. Just a quick little uh, get some fuel and uh, mount the backpack. Five echo control. Go ahead. That's our good friend Toby. One of our many friends at the uh, New York TradeCon. And, uh, yeah, it's great stuff. I know our good friend Mr. Brian was uh, getting a little jealous. He hasn't been on any of the videos recently, so hopefully uh, Mr. Brian will be on, uh, we'll get lucky and get Brian on here shortly. All right. Looking good. Approach. All right, so let's get, uh, we'll go services here. We'll go A cars. The D8 is here, so this is one thing that's very good about TDBRO is we can request the arrival information. So we'll go request, it means you don't have to listen to the voice, it's just boom, right in the FMC here. There we go, ATIS Lima, six miles rain, it's marginal, broken 1500 feet. Uh, eight and four is the split, they're doing the ILS six. Yeah, here's Sears 525, Echo Charlie on the West Coast, seven, one thousand, All right. three thousand. Five to five, Echo Charlie, I did. Approach. Five, Landing data. Okay. Roger. Teterboro for the uh, six approach. Predicted weight, we're going to be uh, nice and light, 10-6. Load the METAR up. It's going to be a wet runway. Winds are calm, 8 degrees Celsius. All right. Landing config is normal, flaps 35. Any ice is off, the factor is good. And we have approach speed at 107, which is our uh, VAP approach, which is if we were landing at flaps 15 and our VREF speed, which is 99, which just changed to 100. So we need uh, 3247, and we have 6,000 available. We'll hit the speeds, and that checks and posts. We'll get the approach right, coming up here. Turn left to Red Farmdale. Yeah, leaving 2,000 left to Red Farmdale 5, Echo Charlie. All right, so the ILS 6 into Teterboro, 108.9, 060 is the final approach course. A 206 of the minimums, 206 is in. So, it's Vings at 2,000 feet. Now, a mandatory crossing altitude at Dandy at 1,500 feet. So that's very cognizant of that. 1,500 feet at Dandy. And how we're gonna fly that is we're not gonna hit the approach button. We're gonna track the localizer inbound. We'll set 1,500 feet in the alt select. We'll use VS or flight level change. Today I'm gonna use VS. We'll bug 1,500 feet and we'll start down and make sure we meet 1,500 feet before we get to Dandy. We'll cross Dandy at 15. Once we're past Dandy, We'll hit the approach button. We'll get on the glide slope and head down on the approach. That's how we're going to fly the approach today. So that is all in and set. We'll load it up. Um, oh, look at this. We're flying right over LaGuardia. This is super awesome. Great view of LaGuardia, Toby. This is awesome. Um, what a beautiful... How that worked out for you? You're clear below you right now? Uh, in and out of the clouds, but it's... Uh, yeah, we got LaGuardia. It's beautiful. Cool. Um... A little now we're back in the clouds here. Um, but you can just see, uh, it's super beautiful. Wow, good old LaGuardia, right? I mean, this is just spectacular. Um, again, some clouds, but just, I mean, we're going to basically fly right overhead uh, Manhattan. Uh, again, a little cloudy, but this is this is beautiful. This is a special treat. Delta 664, how's your visibility? Uh, pretty good, looks like about uh, 8 miles or so. Delta 664, towers 18.7, have a good day. Look at that, this is stunning. I have like goosebumps right now. Frustration is good, seats are good, messages are good. Wow, this is a, uh, this is a treat. The 59th Street Bridge right there. The east side of Manhattan. You can see downtown, wow. Number 
2, Romeo Foxtrot, contact New York, 128.55. 128.55, citation, Terra Foxtrot. Great day. All right. All right, look at this. Wow. Clouds just breaking away just for this. The Empire State Building down there. Freedom Tower. Central Park, flying over Central Park. Well, okay. On your approach, good afternoon, citation to Romeo Fox, 3270, heading. November 2, Romeo Fox, Rod, New York, uh, Roger. United 1729, Roger. Times Square, MetLife Building. The streets look pretty empty. Three, Victor, Julia, New York. New York, uh, Medivac 3 Victor Juliet 1500, climbing 3000. 3 Victor Juliet, climbing, maintain 3000. 3000. Uh, Madison Square Garden, right off the left wing. 3 Victor Juliet, turn left, heading 260. I miss going to Knicks games. 260, 3 Victor Juliet. Number 2 Romeo Foxtrot, proceed direct Vings for an ILS runway 6 approach, altimeter 2972. 2972, direct Vings for the ILS 6 for 2 Romeo Fox. Okay, Vings, direct. With the nav. United 1729, flighting 150 for an ILS runway 4 left approach, altimeter 2972. Uh, 150 for uh, the. Uh, That's not going to work. Garmin uh, likes to do this sometimes, uh, has a Garminism. So, what we might have to do here is if he doesn't clear us before, which he's not, we're going to be heading select direct Vinks. Otherwise, since it's not a flyover waypoint, okay, it's a flyby waypoint. To, uh, um, so, we're going to make sure the heading select is centered and that we won't be an issue going direct uh, Vinks. We'll have to do it manually. Again, that's just staying out of the airplane, being conscious. Um, we know the avionics, we know the Garmin, we know G3000, and we know the, the Garmin-isms um, that can sometimes cause some issues. Because if someone wasn't paying attention there, that could be a serious problem. November 2, Romeo Fox, to the center, maintain 2000. 2000, citation 2, Romeo Fox. Again, we're in visible moisture below 10 degrees Celsius. Engine uh, bleed air anti-air switches are on. There's Newark Airport off the left wing. That's number two Romeo Fox. Right, turn right, direct Dandy. Right, direct Dandy to Romeo Fox. Oh, this is United seventeen twenty nine has Delta. Seventeen twenty nine, Roger. And November three, Victor Juliet. If you Just want, let me know what the work. course setting is for Williamsport when you get there. Yeah. Keep the heading uh, coming in. About uh, three hundred. November 2, Romeo Foxtrot, three miles from Dandy, and uh, cross Dandy at 1,500, cleared ILS runway 6 approach. All right, Dandy at 15, we're cleared the ILS uh, 6 for 2 Romeo Fox. All right, 1,500 feet VS. Oh, he, that was a, it's tight. All right, Dandy's in with the nav. November 2, Romeo Foxtrot, contact Edinburgh Tower, 11 one, one on a point five. All right, 19-5, citation to Romeo Fox. United 17-29, descend to maintain 3,000. Should switch over on its own, but it's not, so that's okay. We'll, we'll, we'll make sure we fix it. Load capture. Past Andy at 15, over Torby. Flaps 15, speed checks. Teterboro Tower, citation, Jeremy Fox, ILS 6, park and jet. Jeremy down. Fox, Teterboro Tower, wind calm, runway 6, clear to land. All right, clear land, runway 6, citation, 2, Romeo Foxtrot. Missed approach altitude's 2,500 feet set. All right, we got gear down three green. Lights are on. I'm sorry, we were just uh, dealing with something here. You said you were clear to land, correct? Turn two, Romeo Fox, affirmative, runway six, clear to land. Clear land six, two, Romeo Fox, thanks. All right, below 161, flaps 35. Again, visible moisture, we're looking good. Before landing, check speed brakes are down. Autopilot's Auto coming off. Your dampener is away before landing checks are complete. You're down three green verifies again.
Graphic Minimums. about five. Minimums. Roger. And Rhino. Right, it's butter again. Right on the thousand foot markers. Speed breaks out. We're not going to kill the brakes. We've had some good landings today. Service here, Romeo Fox, Rod, turn right on Romeo, taxi via Quebec, Lima, Juliet, cross runway one. Romeo, Quebec, Lima, Juliet, and uh, quit across runway one to Romeo Fox. Great day. All right. All right, that's good. Do our flows here. All right, let's go. Up. Clear left, clear right. Well, that was a jam-packed flight. I hope you all enjoyed it. A couple things I wanted to mention. If you do have Instagram, uh, Citation Max one on Instagram. Uh, we post daily content and uh, go give us a follow over there. If you did enjoy the video, the greatest way that you can show support to my channel is hitting that subscribe button, hitting that uh, like button so we get uh, put into the YouTube uh, recommendation engine. And uh, really, just appreciate everyone's support. You all are super, super awesome, and I uh, just hope you enjoy the videos. If there's any uh, uh, comments of, of how we can do videos better or any suggestions, put that in the comments down below. Um, love to hear all your suggestions. Always trying to improve the channel. And we'll see everyone on the next video. Everyone take care. We'll see you. One quick thing I just want to point out um, is, you know, as a kind of on that approach, you know, Garmin was kind of doing some, some, some stuff here, and it's really important to everyone out there learning to fly and just the pilots to make sure you know your avionics and, and that you're watching that because that could have gone, that could have been a bad situation for us if we didn't know Garmin really well and to uh, know uh, the system and, and know how to adjust. Um, but that's just something just to point out uh, really, really important that, you know, you're paying attention when you're coming into the terminal environment, you're getting busy airspace, some interesting vectors and all that stuff, because uh, you gotta stay ahead of that. Otherwise that could have, if we weren't paying attention, that could have caused some issues. Um, so just, uh, just a quick note on that.